Number 8. This is 1949's Lincoln sent with double die obverse. Graded in mint state 67 read by PCGS. At first glance it looks like an ordinary one cent piece in uncirculated mint condition. Because doubling is not that dramatic as in 1955 or 1969 pennies. You'll need closely inspect the obverse details with magnifying glass or by other means to spot slight doubling on the date especially the numerals 1 and 4 in the mint mark. This MS67 gem fetched a sum of $900. Number 7. 2008 Memorial Cent. Graded in Mint State 68 read by PCGS. According to Jamie Hernandez, this is the last year in which the U.S. Mint used the memorial design for the reverse of the Lincoln Cent. The memorial reverse was first introduced on Lincoln Cents in 1959. In 2009, the Mint for the first time ever introduced a four-series design within the same year as a way to honor Abraham Lincoln's life. The 2008 P. Lincoln Cent appears to be very difficult to obtain in MS-67 condition as many coins come with light spotting and scratches. In MS-68 condition they are extremely difficult to find. This lustrous specimen fetched a sum of $956.25 with buyer's fee. Number 6. 1960 Proof Lincoln Cent with Large Date. Graded as PR69 Deep Cameo by PCGS. According to Stax Bowers, vivid, virtually pristine surfaces deliver intense medium orange mint color and a boldly cameoed finish. While the large date is the more plentiful variety of the proof 1960 Lincoln scent, examples such as this that approach numismatic perfection are remarkable condition rarities. It was sold for $2,040. Number 5. 1936 Brilliant Proof Lincoln scent. Graded as PR66 red by PCGS. Otherwise dusky pinkish orange surfaces exhibit a blush of blush of varied color at the upper obverse border that alternates between pale golden pink and steely red as the coin rotates under a light. The strike is full, the finish universally reflective. The first proof scent produced since 1916, the 1936 is the key date issue in the modern proof Lincoln series. It was sold for $2,640. Number 4. 1998 D. Lincoln Cent. Graded in Mint State 69 read by PCGS. MS 69 means the coin is almost perfect in terms of its condition and luster. 69 is a grade on the Sheldon coin grading scale, where 70 is the highest. This superb gem was sold for $5,907.38 with buyer's fee. Number 3. This is 1961 Lincoln sent in PR69 deep cameo condition. As struck with glowing medium orange mint color to fully impressed, sharply cameoed surfaces. This dazzling ultra gem is a surprise condition rarity from a mintage of 3,028,244 pieces. It was sold for $6,600. Number 2. 1917 Lincoln sent with double die obverse. Graded as MS-63 Brown by PCGS. Softly frosted surfaces are richly and originally toned in antique copper rows. The in-hand appearance is exceptionally smooth for the assigned grade, definitely explaining coveted CAC approval. Boldly to sharply struck with superior quality and eye appeal. The 1917 FS-101 is one of the most pronounced double die obverse varieties in the Lincoln Scent series, with sharp doubling to the digits in the date and the letters God we trust in the motto. Despite the dramatic doubling, this variety remained undescribed until 60 years later in 1977, by which time most coins had seen their fair share of circulation. This brown specimen ended up selling for $8,400. Number 1. Here is 1918 D. Lincoln sent in MS66 plus red condition. According to NGC, despite a very high mintage, the 1918 D. sent is rare in top grades. These coins were poorly made, with overused dies that were seemingly set slightly further apart than ideal to extend their lives. Fully struck examples are thus very elusive, and those displaying full red color are extremely rare. Most pieces certified as MSRD have a bit subdued, slightly pinkish color. This specimen fetched a sum of $53,859.38 with buyer's fee at auction. Thanks for watching this video. Consider subscribing to our channel for more captivating numismatic content. Have a good one.